I feel like they're trying to get a code across. I can't trust shit no more. We got to spy. We got to assassin, dog. I got to, like, decipher all this stuff. Maybe I'm wrong as shit. <laughs> Look, I'm about to say, yo, I'm losing confidence, dog. <laughs> This is fiction. Yes, yeah, see, look. <laughs> they had to put that. <sighs> what is good, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the bullshit. Welcome back to the madness. I really wasn't supposed to do this no more. But welcome back to my channel. My name is Cole King Cage, and hopefully I can provide you with some level of entertainment today. Now, check this out. I know you see the title of the video. I know you see the thumbnail. Now, before we get into this madness, please make sure you hit the like, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell for notifications, all that fun stuff in the bag of chips. Now, listen. Listen, Linda, listen. We're about to get into episode two of this spy family, dog. When I tell you the first episode had me hooked, it made me feel things. And you know, I had to do some push-ups. I had to get those fucking, those soft-ass feelings out my fucking chest. You know what I'm saying? I'm supposed to be toxic and shit. I'm supposed to give you all this, you know, aggression and shit. So, you know, I'm, I'm ready this time. I did my workout. I'm good. I'm good now. We good. Let's get started. Ooh, fuck. I'm already feeling this artwork for the damn intro. Too bad I can't. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let's get into this. Oh, okay. So this is the episode. You got to get a wife. Oh, Lord. Well, I mean, you know, we just got done watching the intro. So I know what the, the mom's going to look like. I think I heard that she was supposed to be like the world's deadliest assassin or some shit. I bet she can't cook. I bet she can't cook. You know, I just realized y'all motherfuckers can't hear this shit. Damn. Doesn't it creep you out to sleep? Huh? Oh, there's the boobay. There's the the sweet lady of the show. Oh, she's pretty. Section chief's coffee? Blow snot in it. Uh, do you think snot would make it taste better or something? <laughs> What is this contraption that makes the coffee right here? Because I feel like they got some good ass coffee. This coffee and the one from Tokyo Ghoul, I need in my fucking soul to be real with y'all. You plan on dropping by. Bring it to me and join in the fun. Oh, she gotta go set up her Tinder profile now. It's fine, I guess. I'm still there at City Hall. <laughs> You're kind of weird, so I'm worried about you. Don't be rude. I'm completely normal. Dog, this is a trap, bro. I know all this shit from the fucking trailers, dog. So I'm like, yo, what is she doing right now? Like, how are they like, I feel like they're trying to get a code across. I can't trust shit no more. We got to spy. We got to assassin, dog. I got to like decipher all this stuff. Maybe I'm wrong as shit. <laughs> Look, I'm about to say, yo, I'm losing confidence, dog. <laughs> It's the sweat lines, bro. I'm losing confidence. I can't be. Hold on now. All right, I'm gonna stand fast. I'm gonna stand fast. Something's up. If he finds out I'm lying, he'll think I'm a weirdo and a pathological liar, and things will get even worse. Maybe that is a real brother. I would hate for my brother to skip a promotion on my account. <laughs> hey, Yuri. I want you to know I was just joking about all that earlier. Uh oh, are you and your little brother having a spat? I shopkeeper. Sorry, I didn't realize it was you. It's fine. But I do have a client needing your attention tonight. Oh, princess, the royal. Damn! Oh, y'all saw her eyes change. Yo, oh, this shit is hard. Oh, yeah. Obviously, you can't see. But all right, all right. So maybe, maybe she does have a hard time with actually finding a date and landing and all that stuff. Maybe she is like socially awkward. Okay, that makes sense. I thought it was all a front. Like you know, I'm still thinking about um, Black Widow and shit like that. There it is. Words. Hotel. I'm sorry about this lady, but the entire floor has actually been reserved for the evening, so... Did anyone call for this chick? I don't know. Oh, well, with all due respect... <sighs> oh, man, she about to mark these motherfuckers! There's a traitorous scumbag staying here. Oh, she got a stiletto. Is that a stiletto? What's happening out there? It's an ambush! Some broad just... <gasps> Oof. Excuse oh, me. In the red bottoms too, man. Oh man, see what the Spike Spiegel say. You know, I just love a woman that could kick my ass. 
or kill Vice me. Vice Minister Brennan from the auditing department, I presume? Terribly sorry for the interruption. But tell me, may I have the honor of taking your life this evening? She ain't even got no mask on. Ain't no hiding this shit. She came Code looking name? for blood. Born princess, one of the world's deadliest assassins. She learned the skills of her trade at a very young age, and since then has done whatever dirty work her employers requested of her. She used to be a princess. Oh, wash off. Oh no, not my dress. This is the only nice one I own. I'll have to miss the party. <sighs> Do you have any prospects? Being single at that age is kinda unusual. Bring a date and join in the fun. There's no way. I'll never be a homemaker. Cleaning house is the only thing I'm good at. Scruffy head! <clears throat> Copied all the files of unmarried women from City Hall. Thank you. Gotta find one who won't care you're divorced with a kid, is refined enough for a hoity-toity school, and is willing to get married in 48 hours? If there's a goddess like that, I'd love to meet her. As for me, I can't get a date and I'm not even picky. My condolences. Don't pity me, you jerk! Is it bad to have a kid? Am I keeping mamas away? <clears throat> no, it's not your fault. Just watch some TV and don't worry. Okay. I gotta wonder why you're not just paired up with some lady spy from work. A lot of them were caught in the recent spy hunts, so I couldn't find a match. Lots of rats running loose these days. We're finding the right person might take longer than... Uh-oh! Excuse me. Goodness, you're, it's been too long. Hi, sorry. There go his boobay. As soon as possible, please. Of course, dear. He gotta drop what that Mac Daddy you? game on this so one. Ask me, who is she? Your, your, ah, your Briar, 27 years old, never been married. Both parents are deceased, and she has one brother who's several years younger. They're both civil servants with fairly spotless records. Did I let my guard down? I'm losing my edge lately. Excuse oh. me, I couldn't help notice you staring at me. Is there something I can do for you? <laughs> oh, <laughs> hey, man. Yo, this is a game of chess right here. Wait a second, Linda. Wait a second. Woo, he ain't even turned around. She said, why are you still here? Man, look, when I tell you, I ain't never seen so much game being thrown around right now. No, I'm she sorry. She sensed my gaze. It's just that you're so pretty. Uh, Ooh, oh, jab. Okay. Saying, oh. You have a favorable impression of my physical appearance? Uh, I guess, yeah. Look. You're cute with curves in all the right places. If you knew how to flaunt it, you'd be knocking them dead. Uh, Papa! Oh. I'm this long! They told me! Uh, who's that? A fellow customer. He has a child. I came awfully close to asking another woman's husband on a date. They say people get killed by jealous wives all the time. Well, man, look. I'm, I'm liking this little girl, man. Tanya over here. Reading the brains and shit. That's what I'm talking about. She already know where her job need to be. First. No, calm down, Yor. Don't even think about it. That's exactly the sort of thing that would expose me as an assassin. Don't be weird. What? An assassin? A spy? An assassin? This is so cool. The girl was starved Bless for her heart. entertainment. Hmm. I thought about asking her to play my wife, but I'd better not. <laughs> about asking him to play my boyfriend at the party but that could easily end in bloodshed so i'd better not <gasps> oh poor poor me i'm so lonely because i've got no mama yo tanya is mvp right now come through little girl <laughs> i just need a mama so bad are you not here with your wife um no sadly we lost her two years ago it's just me and my daughter. Buying his ass friends. off. No one will try to kill me for asking him out. Excuse me. That's that's what the fuck I'm talking about, Yor. This is a lesson to any. Look, it's only gonna be like four y'all watching this little video right here. But go ahead and take that as a lesson. It, ladies, if you shoot your motherfucking shot, the possibilities are endless. Cause tr trust and believe. Trust and believe. We gonna be so. 
enthralled and excited. Hell yeah, I'll go out on a date with you, regardless of, you know, what this thing on my finger is. <laughs> I'm bullshitting. But ladies, for real, shoot your shot. Just do it. Just, just trust me. Trust me. I got you. I got you better than all these other motherfucking dating coaches. Go shoot your shot. Pretend to be your... Uh, I don't have any weird ulterior motives or anything like that. And I'll find a way to repay She's you. She's gonna wear your skin. All I want to do is put my brother's mind at ease. You gotta ask more questions. Well, then. Offer accepted. Uh, it, wait, what if it's a weird it's sex like... party? Although, I'd like something in return. Uh, it's a long story, but I'd like you to pretend to be her mother during an interview. Pretend to be her mother? We live in such uncertain times, and I just want my sweet little girl to get into a good school. I have to try, because it was her mother's dying wish. Papa's a big liar. Hey boy. <laughs> this is a relatively simple once. first step, but I'll get her to agree to an official marriage eventually. If you think I'm good for the role, that is. Thanks so much. I suppose we'll see each other Saturday then. Okay. I got a sitter for when you. When they tell each other the you truth. Promise me you'll behave. Lord. Okay, I need some peanuts. Yeah, yeah. Ten pence is your change, Ribbit. Oh. Thanks, Ribbit. Ribbit? A T. No, an F cipher. Must be Damn, man. They got connects, bro. Side mission. Retrieving works of art stolen from the West and wiping out this smuggling ring. The mission is to commence Saturday at 1800 hours when the target meets the buyer. Saturday? Listen up. We'll need to take care of this quickly so I can make that party. Got it? Whoa! Don't you realize I'm just an informant and I couldn't fight my way out of a wet paper bag, right? And your tab is pretty much maxed out. Oh, we about to get a Mr. and Mrs. Smith moment. This is about to be dope, man. Give me less than 10 seconds. 38. Hands. Knock him down, Twilight. Okay. Reinforcements. And a lot of everything to let go already. Oh, yeah. Now, which one of these will go MIA? I'll be taking this. Wait, the diamond? Why you gotta grab the priciest one? Because you know he gotta he gotta make that thing look good now. He gotta he gotta get it to his woman. I get it. This is what having your heart toyed with feels like. But I still need to maintain good work relationships to keep my brother happy. So Oh man, she gonna murk to go. him. If he really stood her up, she gonna murk the fuck out of him. So you finally decided to show up, huh? I'm sorry. I brought a gift for you. Well, it's us. What a lame excuse. Just pathetic. I knew that weirdo was lying about having a boyfriend. You think we should report her? Definitely. She has to be some kind of spy who was sent here for the sole purpose of lowering her country's birth rate or something crazy like that. Come on, stop being petty. She's That's a hell of a reach, but okay. To ask for it to pretend to be normal. You know it makes you look even more pathetic. Hey, knock it off. Bro, she will stop literally split you in two. Oh, I wouldn't sure bark up that tree if I were you. You gave you all by your lonesome. I don't understand. What could she possibly get out of doing something like that? Everyone here were to die, my brother would never hear about any of it. Sorry to but, but, you. but, 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 before she does that, he also knows about Dominic. So Dominic has to survive. And I don't know if Dominic's gonna keep his mouth closed, but we don't know him like that. Some fun, okay? That boy, Twilight about to come up in that thing with that ring, man. We're going for eating. He about to propose in front of everybody to stun on her ugly ass. I guess this nigga has uh -huh. blood on him. Oh, 
He's so fucking smart, bro. I see the game, man. I'm sorry. That made me excited. All right. So check this game out right quick. He pretends to have gotten beaten up. That is a good enough excuse for them. Not her, because she can read that he's bullshitting. But for the rest of them, they're going to see that shit and be like, oh, man, he actually does exist. And he has a valid excuse for not being there on time and making her look like she was alone. That's so fucking smart, bro. I'm feeling this right now. Please forgive my lateness. I'm Lloyd Forger, yours husband. Hey, I needed a boyfriend, not a husband. You're kidding me. I mixed up our missions. <laughs> Mr. Forger, is that blood? Uh, yes, pardon me, please. A patient had a violent outburst. Just one of the risks of being a psychiatrist. You having a good time, Yor? You can't be serious. Uh, why didn't you tell us you were married? I had no idea. Oh, he jumped well, the gun, it's man! Just... It's embarrassing, but this is my second marriage and I have a child. Makes things a bit uncomfortable. <laughs> Don't give me it's that crap. Fault. No freaking way that terminally awkward girl has a hot, successful husband. Now this will be uncomfortable. Oh, oh she's about absolutely. to spill that shit on her. That's some trifling that shit. The oven. Oops, I seem to have tripped on something. <laughs> Oof. Ooh, y'all see that catch? I love that you're so mindful about wasting food, Yor, but I'm not so sure it's good manners to use your feet, you know? Uh, sorry about that. Mm, this is actually very tasty. Isn't it? Tell me, Mr. Ranger. It's Forger. Did you know that your wife did some questionable work before she started at City Hall? What was it again? Yo. Random men. I tell man, look, why she want buy, like why she want these hands so bad, bro? Like leave my leave my little anime family alone, man. Chill out. Would call you up to their hotel room so you could give them massages. Isn't that right? That was a massage was code for murder for hire. Oof. I promise it's not what you think, Lloyd. I just I think it's great. Uh... Truthfully, she lost her parents at a young age. And to care for her younger brother, she did whatever she could. She sacrificed a great deal. Be it for somebody else's sake. Bring a little bit of, you know, simpage out there. To put up there with you such go. A tough job takes real grit and dedication. And that's not something just anybody can do. See, Let's look, she likes him. And okay. she wants him. Thank you so much for having us. Now she's hating on him. Hang on, Yor. Huh? Damn. How did they know where I was? Let me guess. They left a tracking device in the loot. Uh, Why would you take the getaway van from the job with you? What do I say? What do I say? It seems that some of my patients are still having psychotic breaks. Being a doctor must be very demanding. She really believe that? The best course is to avoid them for a bit. Yo, man, he is. Left the Ooh, she, I know she's smart. I know she sees these things. She about to take him out for him. This motherfucker is a horrible psychiatrist. He's like, yeah, man, it's okay to hit your patient's dog. No, it's not. It's literally not. This is fiction. Yeah, see, look. <laughs> they had to put that. Get back. Another one. Good hit. Woo. She put the fucking sweet chin music on that motherfucker. Sorry, I'm not a doctor, so I shouldn't try to treat your patients. But I am kind of an expert at self-defense. My little brother taught me everything he knows. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Lore. <laughs> I must say, that was impressive. Did you see how far the guy went flying? It's crazy. Guess I don't know my own strength. <laughs> there he is! This way! Yeah. Oh my god, bro. You can't lie your way out of that one. They have AKs. Let's swim by city hall. 
Yo, they got those fucking Star Wars Stormtrooper aim right there. Even in sickness or in sadness, no matter what hardships we may face, on her. <laughs> let's do it together. Yeah. Until my mission. Until my killing. Do, do us part. part. Oof. Hey, man, I ain't gonna lie to y'all, dog. Oh, next mission. It's a bunch of images. Nobody's talking. Prepare for the interview. Okay, mission three. All right. I'm not going front with y'all, dog. I'm feeling this show, man. More and more, I'm feeling this show. I'm liking what I'm seeing. I'm liking what we got to go through. So check this out. The way that I see this going's down. It looks like, from my bird's eye view, one, it's on little Tanya to try and make sure that they stay together. She try, she has to try and keep the family together, especially for the long term. Both of them are here for the short term, just like the, the gain of having like the cover. So, you know, everybody's like on edge, on pins and needles, trying to still lie to one another. I'm surprised that she didn't pick up on half the shit that he was lying about if she was so quick to see that he was staring at her. You know what I mean? And like observing her. So that one now nah, was a little iffy right there. But I like the fact that that your already has like you know her coworkers being a bunch of bitches trying to watch over her you know what i'm saying like watch watch everything that she does and like you know put pressure on her side for her to maintain cover because they think that she's a spy as well like that shit right there i'm liking what i'm seeing right there but ladies and gentlemen alas that is the end of the episode yo i greatly appreciate you coming through and kicking it with me man and look me man <laughs> sorry Thank y'all so much for coming through and kicking it with me. Please make sure on your way out the door, hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the bell for the notifications. Comment how you felt about the episode too, man. Like, look, come on through, man. Come on through. But above all else, ladies and gentlemen, go forth and do great things, y'all. Peace. Where the fuck is this? Stop recording.